Hello, we're here in the Solid Optics um, test center. And this is our um, switch where we test our CWDM muxes with. I've got all the 18 colors here. Uh, this is the 1610 up to the 1270. Uh, we get some requests on our Solid Optics power meter for this um, with the lambda sign so you can set the frequency. This has to do that the detector inside and all the detectors are more sensitive for specific colors than other colors. But this detector will detect all the light there is. I'm setting this on 1550 nanometer, the 1610 up to the 1270 are all working on, on it and I will just plug it in different light types uh, and all the colors are detected in, in this because this is a specific detector that is working for all the lights so it's not specific for colors I can check all the colors the detector is sensitive or more sensitive to specific light it has a specific curve for that as you can see here the device doesn't know which type of light it is receiving. If I'm testing, for example, the 1310 here, and I want to have the correct value, I have to set it to a specific value. As you can see here. There's not a big difference here because uh, 1310 or 1330 will be here but the device doesn't know which light it receiving and it w ha can correct it to the specific light there is so if you want to have more or less the correct value in dbs you have to set it to the nanometer where it is close to as you can see the 1610 here or the 1550 the the graph is more or less uh, straight but there is a big difference here with the 1310 and of course with the 1850 so if you're testing multi-mode multi 850 lights you have to set it to that light or 1310 you have to set it to that light otherwise your dbs are not correct thank you very much